All right, now privacy is something that is obviously very important in a business environment. And Windows 10 gives you pretty good privacy controls um, right in the system by default. So what you can do is come into the settings application and you should see a section that's labeled privacy. So first of all, we have general privacy. You have different uh, app options here. So this list lets apps use your advertising identification. Um, so essentially applications can look at analytical data about your browsing habits to serve appropriate advertisements to you. So there are some free applications which remain free by offering advertisements. So you can turn this off so that those apps do not have access to your advertising ID. Now this third one is one that is pretty important. People kind of feel uncomfortable about this option here. Having it on allows Microsoft to gather data about things that you are typing. Now, this is not something that is necessarily used for advertising. Of course, we don't know what's going on behind closed doors, um, but it's, instead it's basically to help them improve um, speech recognition, pr uh, predictive text, things like that. Um, so if you don't want that, it, that information sent up to Microsoft, then you can go ahead and turn that off. And then lastly, we have let websites provide locally relevant content by accessing my language list. So essentially it knows what languages you have installed on your keyboard. So we can drill down into specific privacy settings for different apps for all of these different options here. Location, camera, microphone, speech, inking and typing, account information, contacts, calendar, so on and so forth. So there are a lot of different options here. Let's take a look at camera. So I can see that these applications have access to my camera. Now on most devices, if your camera is on, it will be required in terms of hardware that a light turns on to notify you that, that the uh, camera is on and watching you. Um, however, if this still makes you uncomfortable, you can turn off any app that you do not want to have access to your camera. Same goes for microphone and really for all of these other different options. So if, if you do not want certain information being shared with any specific application, you have that option right here. Now, if you don't see an application listed under this privacy, that means that that application has not requested that uh, or access to that hardware. So obviously I have a lot of applications installed that are not showing up here. And what that means is that they have never requested to access my camera. So they do not have access to my camera even though they're not listed here.